You know, your holster's not as much fun as you might think. I'm ready for whatever's clever. Hey, you got any uh, jetpacks in stock? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Ah, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Okay, great. So where where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Fuck! God damn it. Okay, well let's let's just give Gene the update. Pleasure doing business with you. Come back soon. Oh, power slide! You, over there, come over here. I've got some food for ya. Yeah, that's right. Food, I said food. Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I'm Blordo. You here for the food? Or the other stuff. <laughs> what, what do you mean, other stuff? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Forget I said anything. <laughs> no, come on, we're, we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine. I sell secret shit if you know what to ask for. But don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. Perfect. Good day to you, food customer. Not even a TV show, it's just you and me. Put me next time. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that's, that sounds like a good idea. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. Hey, good night, partner. I'm just going to sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry, I'm, I, I, I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Partner, let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Holy shit, this rules! Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack pro. Are you tired of your regular taking your pills situation where you have to put all your pills in like a first day through last day kind of? Nice! Remember before the jetpack when we... Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You can fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. Clean it up before Tweet 
gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck off, Jean, like you've even ever been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fucked more aliens than your brain can comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot though, right? Oh, come on. You haven't even seen him. Why'd you answer that? Trust me, you don't have to support her just because she's family. This guy's a loser. He is so hot. He's like a low seven or a high six. And he's really nice to me. Yeah, no ulterior motives there. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great. Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, look, we've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. Excuse me? No, sorry, but I am not about to let this fuck-up degenerate school me on life decisions. The fact that I'm a fuck-up degenerate is exactly why you should let me school you on life decisions. I, I know better than anyone what not to do. You're both assholes. Yeah? Well, you're gonna get this twee guy pregnant, and then I'll be here to tell you I told you so. Then who's gonna have to deal with all your mutant kids running around this house? Me! Yeah, not that it matters, but I'm the one who would get pregnant. Not the way his species works. They get pregnant real easy. I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Twig. Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. Thank you. Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Jean, okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. <laughs> Okay, well, no guarantees we're gonna save them again, but wh wh where are they? They're working at Screndel Labs now, just past the Mushroom Valley here. Just be careful, that place is freaky. Thanks! Good use. Nice, we're really flying, huh? Really cool stuff, in Bounty Hunter, like we're flying. Not 
gonna let me take a break, huh? Good team. This isn't wrapping up anytime soon. Uh, hey, buddy, may maybe maybe you just want to take a nap. Uh, yeah, go ahead and just lie down on the floor and, and, and rest up while I while I continue shitting. And, and then when I'm done shitting, I'll, I'll wake you up. Okay? Uh, sounds good. Scrandal Labs is like I mean, I, I mean like I I know a little bit I mean I I, I heard a bit so so I kind of know but I, I'm just making small talk right now you know I'm just trying to I'm just trying to fill the dead air it's really uncomfortable I mean don't get mad at me if what I'm saying isn't that interesting because you know I'm, I'm doing my best here you know 
This is the real meat and potatoes of our adventure, you know? Just good old-fashioned combat. Hello, and welcome to Scranda Labs. Only authorized personnel are allowed beyond this point. You gotta be kidding me. It's fucking Helen! Oh, you're the bounty hunter who helped us out with all that paperwork and killed my boss, Krubus. <laughs> <laughs> we really appreciated that. But, sorry, I need to let the G3 know that you're here. Just my job. Nothing personal. You're, uh, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. G3 are coming for you. Sorry, it's my job. And I don't care about you. Oh, shit, here they come. You know, hey, at least the elevator is working now. Take a look around this place, you know, let's see what kind of experiments they're doing here. Would you like to do the honors? We're going to try to show up those cocky nerds in the weapons lab by fusing this human with some other aliens. Just hit the button. Uh, no, you, you know, I, I don't think we're qualified to, to, to make that decision. Look, I can do it myself if you don't want to. I'm just trying to be nice. Kidding me? Hmm. That wasn't supposed to happen. They died. What the fuck are you doing? Why, why'd you press the button, bounty hunter? Complicated for us right now, buddy. Let's fuck shit up. Ow. Ow. Damn it. Sheesh. 
Whoever works here really needs to get their shit together. What a mess. Oh God, are those Gatlians? I think I'm gonna be sick. Oh my God, that's, I wonder if he's, Never mind, never mind. We gotta move. Wait, I think that one's alive. Oh, hey, you look nice. My name's Creature. The bad guys did experiments on me and fucked me up real bad in basically every way you can imagine. Holy shit, am I glad to see another cat laying alive in here? Uh, are there any other? Oh my god, yes! There's so many! Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no! These fucking G3 bastards! Creature, we're taking on the cartel! You want in? Oh, no, no, no! They take good care of me! Holding me against my will, cutting me open, doing experiments on me! Okay, you know what? Say it out loud! I think they might actually be bad! I'm part of your team now! Hell yeah! Welcome aboard, uh, Creature! The, the... That, 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 that's your name? I guess so. Oh, hey, we're locked in, but that's fine. Don't freak out or anything. I can give birth to a bunch of little freaks and they can disable the door lock. It's fine. Oh, yeah. Ah, beautiful. Look out, one of my little fuckers just saved us. Being a dad is the best feeling in the world. Then a few seconds later, when your mutant kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan, that's not so good of a feeling, actually, but I'm numb to it. Oh, yeah, that's one of my children. They died fast. Don't worry, it's easy to make more, and it feels good. God, I love them so much. They grow up so fast, then they die. It's pretty rough being a dad. Do not recommend it. I've had so many kids, and I'm going to have so many more. I recommend it. It's the greatest feeling in the world. Hurts to get birth doing though. Hey, I don't want to be annoying, but you could use me to get into the weapons crafting center. Hope that's not annoying to say or anything. Sorry to speak up without asking, it's just you should use me here. Ah, who are these cute critters? Inside.
How's it going? All right, we're in. How was that? Was that helpful? Was it helpful that I gave birth to a lot of tiny guys really fast? Hey, is this gonna hurt? Is this gonna hurt getting a weapon grafted to my arm? You're gonna graft a Gatlian to my arm, and that's gonna be permanent? Is that right? Because I'm I'm obviously down to do it. I'm just a little scared that it's gonna hurt a lot, and that I'm also gonna regret not being able to- Intruders! Hey, I can fight too! Let me help! Bones with the body! What you got in mind? Ah, go shoot me to the body! Zombified Gatlians onto Mercs in here? <gasps> Holy shit! No! Hello! Holy shit, you killed everyone? Wow, you are strong. Good thing I'm safe behind this glass. Oh! Use one of my kids to fuck with that guy's mind! He'll go into a frenzy. Did I tell you they can do that? We can do that. Shit. They can make a bad guy fight for us. Oh shit. That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep yelling at my kids to make them last longer, but they're shitheads. They do not listen. You ready for my trick hole? Because it's ready. Okay, where are we now? Back outside? Let's do this! Oh, I can help you with that little hook bug hive. Shoot my little guys in there. Look at my little guy in there rustling up the hive. Isn't that cute? I'm so proud of him.
Let's use my glob shot. Jeez, another battle, another pile of dead fucking dumb G3 bodies. Listen, Bounty Hunter, you wanna maybe try using Clug's device to save those humans? No, but please. You know how to use Clug's device, yeah? Let's save those humans! There we go! Oh my god, a politician who actually gives a shit! Be free, little humans! Be free! Some people need no introduction. Here I am. You think you can just come to hell in here and fuck with me? You know who I am? I'm Jonathan fucking Strendel, a.k.a. the hot Strendel brother. Up yours! Oh, hey, Jonathan. I think we're gonna kill you. tell you but you know we can use this portal to head back to blim you know whenever we want but uh also find trudging forward let's fuck shit up i'm just getting warmed up Do this. That's right, you need old 
McKinney. shot every now and again, you know? My turn! Hey, I'm ready to give birth one. I don't know if you knew this, but I can help you here. This is totally my thing. I'm good at it. That's Angela Scrindle! Wanna kill him? Oh, fuck! The bounty hunter's here! Holy shit, is that another Scrindle? The, 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 they're getting away! My trick hole's ready for you! Let's glob him! If only they were all this week, you know? God, I cannot imagine a universe without the G3. You know, they, they, they've just always been there, operating in the shadows, skirting the law. Everybody's too scared to take them down, so, so they just keep doing all their evil shit, enslaving planets, kidnapping useful species. Huh, are we sure we're gonna be able to do this? I feel like someone more- So you finally need me again, huh? Hey, 
Hey, Brad, what do they got you watching today? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like, oh, what the hell? What, what is this? What is this? Why is this in here? I'm trying to jack off. This is really distracting to me, but I'll still be able to do it. Trust me, I, I've been through a lot. Uh... Go on, have a good life! Not gonna let me take a break, huh? Sweezy's ready for blood! How's it going for you? stuff enjoy your meal I mean uh, purchase oh that's a delicious one I've been slobbering on that one you're lucky to get that one hey asshole we can see you hiding in there no you can't fuck off fuck you Damn it! Why do they keep running? Ah, Jesus Christ! I, why are you still following me? Fuck, we gotta keep running. D you're not out of breath yet, are you?
bitch with, with these fucking scrindles. It's like playing whack-a-mole. Whoa, that was creative. That nice work. Ready for carving? Oh, alien biology. Always like, it's just, it's just fucked. It's just fucked, really. Good, delicious. Now let me dig into the last bro. Each one more visually better than the last. You know what? I don't see this often, but I'm fully sated right now. I actually need a rest. You there, bounty hunter? Fuck, it's Garmantuous? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how fucked you made things for yourself. You were living in heaven before you meddled with the G3. Fuck you! You're just afraid because we keep killing off your goons! Bounty Hunter, I've got the two most important people in your life, and I'm going to kill them. <laughs> oh, but not right away. First, I'll make things miserable for them. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me suffer. You monster! I'm not going to ask you to stop. I doubt you'd listen. I'd just like to inform you that I'm going to make sure you die. And that it's going to hurt. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight until I come to kill you myself. Fuck. Guess we've really awakened the beast now. 
All right, well, you know, we never did figure out, you know, who's the boss uh, uh, of those guys, but, you know, let's pack it in and, and head home. Ah, you killed the Skrendel brothers and freed us again. Thank you. Thank you. Fire, aren't you? Obviously, you're not as good at bounty hunting as I used to be, but hey, I'm gloppy enough to admit you're doing pretty damn well. Turn in that bounty. Hey, uh, I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads, maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean, my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but we'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Frendelos. Oh, hey, I I'm Tweeg. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweeg, you need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my Frendelos and tongue kiss your sister? I one who bought those fucking friendalos and leave Tweeg alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Tweeg. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's just after our house. It's our house. Exactly. Hey, Tweeg, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. Real heartbreaker. I'd get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. Aww. Not you, Tweeg. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You really gotta take my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey, your family's doing a great job. You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as... I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic! Tell him how pathetic he is. Hey, right, come on. Don't make it sound so sad. Look, I admit I wasn't in a good place when you found me, but I feel like I'm part of your family now. I'm basically your dad now. You too, Lizzie. I'm your dad. I'm just worried about you dating this weird freak who just wants to steal my couch away from me. You can call it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Tweeg. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Tweeg. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? No! Because I... Because I'm concerned! You barely know this guy, and it's dangerous out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Tweeg moving in, right? Good. Like I needed your approval anyway. This is a mistake. Ugh, that's enough of this. Tweeg, let's go to the park. To... <laughs> to... to kiss? <laughs> yeah. Anybody got a fucking problem with that? Eesh. Sorry I said anything. Let's just get back to the bounty hunting. Can't wait to show you those new commercials. You, uh, you seen Merv? Uh, no. All right. Here's the skinny. 
You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. What? More, more than we already have? Uh, our team is mostly guns. Trust me, we need this. Klug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. Oh shit, another Gatlian! That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Okay, so what do we do? We do it the old-fashioned way. And ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. Okay, Gene, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll try to find him ourselves. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Bounty Hunter, it's me, Sudo, again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Suddenly? With the fucking detective mode? Well, why haven't we had access to this the whole time? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a... Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately, and... No matches found. Oh, well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? Okay, I figured it out. This thing's fucking useless. Thanks, Gene! Hey, uh, did, did you know anything about Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Let's ask them some questions. What? Why do you care? If you must know, I ate 15 whole sandwiches. And yes, I regret it. I don't know why I ate that many. Am I... what? What is it with you and this Dr. Giblets guy? My name's Craig and I'm really sick from eating a lot of sandwiches. Leave me alone. Do I look nervous? <laughs> oh, jeez, you're making me nervous with this interrogation. I'm really sorry. I don't know who that is. But <laughs> good luck, I guess. Hope you find them. Woof, they didn't know anything. That was a real D-rank interrogation. Sorry. Oh, well, maybe you could just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it next time. Hey, uh... Hey, tough guy, we're, we're looking for a Dr. Giblets. You got, you got any leads? Slick, what the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. What's my whole deal? Like, who am I? What do I do? Well, my name's Jackie T. Pooperton, and what I do is tell you to fuck off! Quit the, the drug guys. No! I don't have any fucking ties to the evil drug conglomerate. I'm a normal person trying to live a normal life in the city. Why in the fuck would I have any ties to the G3? How you doing? Like, with your weird interrogation? Awful! Annoying! I wish you'd stop! I don't know, and I don't give a shit. I'm busy. You need anything else, or can I fucking go? Ooh, bummer, they were a tough cookie. But they were telling the truth according to my sensors, so let's say that was a C-rank interrogation. Better luck next time, let's look for somebody else. Hey listen, uh, if you find a drum anywhere, my buddy Globo here, you know, he'd really love one. He's great, he's a good drummer. And I think it would help him, you know, he's a good musician. I think it would, he, trust me, it'd be worth your time. Yeah, you know, uh, we'll, we'll keep an eye out for you. Hey, sorry, yeah, no, he can't talk. He just sort of makes that noise. Huh, that's, uh, that's unfortunate for him. Hey, uh, do you mind if we have a moment of your time? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about, can I ask? I was playing snooker with Blordo. Yeah, he's really bad at it, so I won a few hundred pesos. <laughs> it was a great night. Hey, thanks for asking about my night, pal. It was nice of you. You take an interest.